VW Bond here. Hey, I'm just making a quick video. Um, Apple Soldier is, is being adamant about the fact that um, what he showed in his video as regards to RAID and his Mac Pro, uh, us people that use Windows, you know, we we can't do our our computer can't do that. Our Windows based workstation can't do that. It just we can't do what he showed in that video and it's just he's just dead wrong he's dead wrong and I'm at the Apple website not only is he wrong he started with the schoolyard thing of calling names he called me an idiot and I'm just like God you call me an idiot and you're the one that's wrong just so you guys know I've been watching Apple Soldier's videos for a couple of years now. I think he's really entertaining. A lot of times he got some good information. I like the guy's videos, but on this point, it's just it's just wrong. It's wrong. Anyway, said so I'm gonna keep this short. Um, this is the 20 Mac Pro right here. Let me just go away so you guys, everybody can see that I haven't configured anything already or whatever let me just click around all right let me go and click on mac pro just the quad core i'm going to click on select here what you got your processor 2.66 xeon air quad core got your three uh gigs of memory there but when you get down here to raid card i'm thinking raid card a mac pro already had can do hardware raid well what is this raid card but what are you talking about so of course i clicked on learn more hey let's see what apple's talking about here because all the workstation pcs that i've ever been around they have raid already on the card um you know so i don't i don't know what he's talking i, I don't know what he's talking about um you know they got some they go through the raid levels here which you know us geek people already know about when you get to the first within the first paragraph they tell you the new hardware raid option new hardware raid option so they didn't have it before what are you talking about supports raid levels zero one five zero plus one and enhanced just a bunch of discs okay that that's what it does cool what a but this is the thing. To get hardware raid on a Mac Pro, you gotta pay seven hundred dollars for it. It's right here. Nobody's making this up. You gotta I mean I know to 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 a person that uses um, Windows, Linux like myself, this is just hilarious. And and frankly it's embarrassing for, for Apple to me. Seven hundred dollars for a raid card on a on a machine. Add it on to a machine that already cost twenty five hundred. Are, are you kidding me? Nope, they're serious, guy. And and the first hard drive you got here is your um, what is this? You got a six. You got a six forty seventy two hundred RPM SATA. Cool. But you ain't got no RAID. Your the 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 machine itself can't do hardware RAID. It just doesn't have the functionality unless you spend seven hundred dollars. Period. So let's go ahead and click that. There you go. Now we're at thirty two hundred. We're at thirty two hundred dollars, guys. Now you know what? What I'm I'm gonna go. Let's pick on Dale. Let's pick on Dale today. I'm gonna go over www Dale. <sighs> Let's see. Workstations. And we're just we're just gonna stick to the point of raid here. You know what? Precision. Let's let's go with oh I see Xeon. Okay. 949. Let's go with that. Let's get let's configure this bad boy. Let's see. The Mac is at 3200 with just having a functionality of the one hardware rate we're at 3200 here cool not a problem that's what they're at let's look at processor there we go we need to six it this is the processor right here that quad core xeon there we go where are we at we at 2100 now let's go over the memory it's got to match up we're at nope you need ECC. You need ECC. 
There we go. Now, where when you when you get to the hard driver, you can add up to four extra drives. You can pay for them to add because it already has RAID built in to the motherboard of the system. You don't have to pay seven hundred dollars extra to this. Period. You don't have to. You don't have to do it. RAID configuration. Look at this. If I want four extra drives, if I want RAID 5, it says zero. That's because if you click on this, it's going to tell you hard drive selection. That RAID configuration needs a total of three drives. So you're going to have to go over here and add three other drives here. Three other drives. Which, that's not a problem. But the point is the board, the machine, already has RAID functionality in it because it's a workstation. So we got same. Let's go back here. We got same memory, same memory, same processor. And the ability to do RAID 3200. Go over to the Dell side 2300 for the same thing. Now, I could also go over here and add, um, you know, two other drives, and it still probably wouldn't even come up to um, 3200. So I'm sorry. You call me names. You. Said I, you said I was an idiot. I didn't know what I was talking about, but Eric, you're wrong on this one. You're wrong on this one, guy. Um, continue making your videos. They're hilarious. Sometimes you have some good information, but stick to the stuff you know about. If you don't know what a PC can do, or you, you know, don't just jump and make videos and say that, hey, a MacBook Pro can do this, and you guys is, you know, a Windows workstation can't do it. When it can, and it can do it for less on a workstation. It can do it for less. This is all I got, guys. Uh, keep making videos. Go ahead and uh, subscribe to me if you want to. It's whatever, whatever. Eric, you embarrassed yourself on this one. I'm out.